Alright guys, so today I'm down here on uh, Brisbane River, as you can tell behind me, the city, just there. And I'm going to be using some bread, trying to catch some brim. And I'm going to show you guys just how easy it is to catch brim in your local rivers and creeks. Yeah, so it's really good fun. Let's get into it. Yep, got a fish. Whoa. Alright. <laughs> Second drop. Got a fish. What is it? I think it might be a brim. Oh, there's fish all over the place. Get them away from the snakes. Oh, it's a nice it was brim. Oh, have a look at that. Second drop. A bit of bread. Spoil up. Let's go. Oh, have a look at that. Phew. Good size one, actually. Oh, come on, mate, come on. I'll get the hook out of you and let you go. Come on. Let's get that out and then let you go. Okay, nice little brim going straight back. Okay, so um, when, you, when you're fishing for a brim, so with the slices of bread, this part in the middle, so the white bit, um, that's normally what you want to use for bait, because it's softer, you can mould it on the hook. So what I do, is I just come up, peel off the crust, just like this, and then keep this for bait. What I do is I just pull, pull past this and this, and it floats on the surface, and then this, um, this really gets um, the brim, the brim up on the surface and feeding because this this crust stuff it floats, so it works pretty good for that. And then this stuff, what you want to do is um, keep it in, in the bag so it stays fresh and soft. Okay, guys. So all you got to do to catch these brim is get a little bit of bread like this, small hook. So the rig simply just um, so I've got like. A little bead up here just to stop the float and then I've got a float here just like that if there's a little bit of current so there is at the moment I've got a little weight here just to hold the bait down so once you get this white white bit what you want to do to put the bait on just get your hook all you really need is a small sized octopus hook or a long shank hook works best so it fits in their mouth and um, what you want to do just put it in the middle and then you can just kind of mold, mold the bread around the line and the hook just like this and then if you've got a bit too much at the end just chuck that off into the belly like that brim. But you want to make sure you've got a little bit of a hook point sticking out like that the brim will come along and straighten the corner of the jaw Looks like another brim. Little brim. Nice little brim just there and a little bit of bread. We'll get him back. I'm not sure if you guys can see that, but I've just let out a big load of bread and just uh, down in the current, just washed down and there's heaps of brim smashing it up on the surface and I've got me f my float down there so hopefully we can get some brim. Yep, go on. It's a good size one. <laughs> My last bit of bait. This is definitely a bigger fish. 
these. On the brim. Oh, I know, it's just a hard fighter. It's actually pretty small. guys nice little brim to end the day there he is on a bit of bread really good bit of fun we'll let him go all right guys hope you enjoyed the video so um you just remember keep it simple um let's brim like a good bit of bread make sure to share this video with your mates if you found it um helpful because it's uh, definitely good fun getting out there, catching a few brim on an overcast day. There's not much happening. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching. Like, subscribe for more, and we'll see you next time.